I call this lowered expectations. It's a miracle this piece even printed. I was just so desperate to have it print because I wanted this piece because I'm going to use it next that I held down this for about two hours and 12 minutes. I've got something either very wrong in there or there is something very wrong with PLA in general. I'm not sure which. I haven't figured it out yet. Uh, maybe the wheel needs to be tighter or less tight. All I know is every once in a while it would lose. This is There is probably some horrible, horrible problems with this because every once in a while it would lose pulling and you could feel like it's supposed to be extruding both lights would be on but you could feel that it wasn't going down and then I don't know if you could hurt any of that if I just covered up the mic so you couldn't feel it going down uh, and, and if you couldn't feel it going down I found that by jiggling this around or twisting it or pushing it down really hard eventually I'd get it to catch again and then it'd be fine for a while so I'm convinced that it's that the motor is just not able to to grab the PLA and whether that's that it's already wound down and ground down that that area uh, you know by making the little teeth marks uh, that it does this is ABS but you know maybe it already ground down the teeth in that area and it can't get a good grip or uh, or what I'm using a, a recompiled firmware I put on here that does not back up so it doesn't back up the motor so that's why there's lots of ooze um, but it still had the problem so you know the theory that I was talking with people on ERC about that maybe there was a blockage in the chamber and it was getting pulled back up and then it was cooling down nope that's not what's happening uh, I think it's all about grip from in there uh, anyway X carriage upper, which I'm going to clean up. I'm going to make this work, even if I have to put washers on top of these end pieces to make it tall enough. And uh, I'm putting it on top of that. Lowered expectations.